everyone welcome back with another tutorial of matlab i have received this question how we can save a high quality or high resolution image in matlab um, probably you can do that very easily in matlab and um, some people need that because they submitted their paper in general and general is asking for a high quality image a high resolution image or maybe in, in submitting they want to display some high resolution images so you can do that and let's start so we can plot this first and you can see i have plotted these five dots so we will focus on this middle dot and what you have to do is you have to go to file and then you have to go to export setup and within that you will have to go to rendering and within rendering uh, you have to select here custom resolution so dpi you can see 150 300 600 and auto so if you save to auto it will pick a, a lower one um, while if you want to select maybe 300 or 600 dpi or 150 dpi if you want to decrease the size you can choose one so we can select 150 and 600 and see how is the difference 150 and apply to the figure and let's export it um, let's say I want to save it at desktop to see quickly um, and I want to save it as a tip file compressed image so save and now I want to go ahead with 600 dpi and I want to apply it to the figure and then export it and now again um, let's say giving it a name of 2 and now we'll see how is the difference desktop this is 2 which is high resolution and I want to open the other image side by side so let's zoom in this first which is the low resolution in the middle lot to see and now let's see this one so definitely you can see both are of the same size but there is a difference in the resolution let me zoom in a little bit more and you will more clearly see it now you can see it now you can see the difference so definitely you can save high density high dpi images and probably submit it to your um, journal uh, let me quickly show you another thing um, let's say i want to plot it again yeah here is the figure uh, you can go to the export setup and here you can see you can change the color as well if you want to go to the grayscale uh, if the image is colored and you want to grayscale you can go you can choose black and white um, you can choose different fonts different lines different sizes yeah so you can select what size of image you want to save definitely you can do it in the code but if you don't have a code and you have a figure someone sent you a figure uh, you can alter that over there as well so I hope this will help you, um, please don't forget to subscribe and like the videos. See you again in another tutorial, um, till then bye bye.